Hey guys, this is Verbos Tiger from Ghostfire Studios, and today I'm going to bring you a multiplayer gameplay of Black Ops. This is Team Deathmatch, and it's on Array, which happens to be one of my favourite maps. However, saying that, all the maps so far on Black Ops are my favourite maps, as I haven't found one I don't like, and I've probably played on them all, being level 50. So, today I'm using the FAMAS with Silencer and Red Dot Sight. I use the Square with Crosshairs as my reticle. But primarily because I find that easier to aim with when it, than other crosshairs. And sorry if I talk a lot this game, but as I said, this is my first multiplayer commentary and I'm a bit nervous. I'll try to do my best. So, I'm also using Scavenger, Warlord, Second Chance Pro, so I can be revived when in Second Chance. Frag and Overgas with Claymore as my equipment. And as my pistol, I'm using the M1911, I believe it's called. I can't remember. Sometimes I get that mixed up because of all the numbers. I'm not very good at remembering numbers. Probably why I was never good at maths. <laughs> also, my kill streaks are 3, 7, 11, which is spy plane, attack chopper, and dogs. And to be fair, so far this game, I have not really found any kill streaks to be overpowered in Black Ops. Um, the attack chopper is perfectly balanced. It's not completely useless like it was in Modern Warfare 2. And the dogs are powerful as you are the same amount of power as you would expect from an 11 kill streak, which is what I'm using as my 11 kill streak this game. Primarily because I have a contract which I need to get, which is torn limb from limb, which means I have to get the dog's kill streak in a game, which is what I was aiming to do this game, and I achieve it very well. As I, I know I put up a good performance this game, but I can't remember exactly how well I do, as I said. So, here's me trying to take out a guy behind a barrier, but I can't quite see him, so put some shots at him and I hit him through the little gap in between the fence and the, and the barrier. Also, um, as I mentioned earlier, I'm level 50 and I'm currently deciding whether to prestige on this account or not. I'm not sure whether to try out all the guns first, and I'm considering all my options kind of thing before I prestige. I don't tend to like not prestiging though, because I find not ranking up very boring, and it kind of saps the fun out of the game for me personally. Also, I like re-unlocking all the weapons again, I find that quite fun. However, I'm not sure I want to lose all my COD points and everything, so I probably won't do that. I'm not sure, I'm still thinking about it. And... I've been playing a lot of games with my friends, which is Matt Rock Solid, Waza Hudson, Trogdor, 253 I think it is. Um, we're all doing, we're all playing a team called TNC, which is just a little fun clan that we have. And um, we've been doing quite a few good performances. We don't often lose, so I might put a couple of, uh, might commentate over a couple of my better games with them. And put that up on the Ghostfire Studios channel. Matt might do the same with a couple of his games. So we'll see how that goes. And you might be able to see a couple of games of us all playing together. And in this game, as I said, I play, I'm play. i just got my attack chopper. And I've just called it in. I could, for some reason the theatre doesn't show you where you, the map where you place it. So it doesn't tell me where I put it. But I think I put it over where they were currently spawning, which is right where I am at the moment. I'll get a nice little assist on that guy. And my chopper starts going to work, getting a load of kills, which is always good. <laughs> it's never bad, is it? There we go, I've got payback. How dare he kill me. Well, as you can tell, as you can tell by watching this, the FAMAS is quite a good powered gun. I don't personally think it's too overpowered. However, a couple of people I know would be inclined to disagree with that. As I've been told, it's quite an overpowered gun, similar to the AK-74U. But I haven't found either of those guns to be overpowered, as none of them are, e are in my commonly used weapon cycle. Because I have like a main cycle of weapons which I use, which at the moment is the Lee Enfield, the Commando, the, uh, the FAMAS is in one of my custom slots, but it's not one of the ones I use commonly. I use the AK-47 a lot. And those are really my three most used guns. 
According to my combat record, the Lee Enfield is my favourite gun, but I'd say it's probably the AK-47, to be fair, because it's got an amazing amount of power. However, it's still fairly accurate. And there we go, I've got my 11 kill streak and called in my dogs. Which, as I said, were annoying in World at War, so 7 kill streak, but I think they're perfect as an 11 kill streak in Black Ops, as, you know, it's what you, they do what you'd expect from an 11 kill streak, which is absolutely tear things up. Yeah, and I believe we also win the game quite heavily. Partially because our team just did quite well. I'm not sure on that though. You're going to have to... Currently we're winning 6,900 to 3,200. So it's a good bet that we're going to win quite heavily. <laughs> and there we go. My dogs are just picking up the last few kills. So I'm going to have to wrap this commentary up, guys. So this has been a Black Ops gameplay commentary. Please comment, rate and subscribe. Any constructive criticism on my commentary is welcome, and I'll see you all next time I release a video, guys.